here we are. We are back. We are ready for another go. Now here's the question. Both times we did it, it offered us exile. No one steals from a Reckoner Lord, and yet I did. I had my reasons. And it also offered us exile. What if it had been different? In another history, did I survive? Which is always available after we've lost. So. Is there any difference between the two? Last time we just restarted totally fresh. I think we'll try this one. There might not be any difference at all. Okay. Four starters. Are these symbols in the same locations? Yep, cats right there. That means Lithuania has its, yep, little crosses. We're going to move everything up off of the map. We're going to put our decades in the far corner. Looks like we're going to start in Venice. Do we always start in Venice? I don't know. Eldritch started in Paris once, so no. Okay, here we are in Venice. So... It looks like whatever is, whatever city this is directly on the border of France or Germany, that is the nearest, either that or Austria is the nearest uh, location with a symbol. All right, we've learned our knife's secret. don't have the talk to people option yet. There we go. I have a wound and I can talk to people. In a, in a minute I can talk to people. Let's start checking out Venice. Now initially our goal is make money and like acquire assets so that we can travel around. I'm not going to purchase this just yet, because I have no way to defend it. I have, because I have no way to defend it. Uh, let's look while we also talk to this ally, a, a, parent, a potential ally. Okay. So, here we are in Venice. There is no symbol, and there is an ally with a vault. And doing the vault will gain us the ally. Yeah, Fallen London is... That's, uh... Fail Better Games. Uh... With Sunless Sea and Sunless Skies. Okay. Here is an official connection, which makes me feel confident that I could, if I needed to, defend that. So now I have a curio of a bohemian saint. trying to get some aspects uh, so that we can do this ally mission. Got tranquility. I mean, I guess let's just go see what it's about. Yeah. Start off with tranquility, see where we can go from there.
Okay, underworld contact. That's good. Okay, what does this require? Forge? Well, she is forge, right? Yeah, okay, so she'll take care of that. I think I am going to get... What if just right out of the gate we go like kind of heavy trying to make stuff happen here? Alright, got an underworld connection. This person will try to steal from us eventually. Brand townhouse, can't afford it. Uh, we should probably find the next place to go just in case. It's called the Ivory City and is the only place to share the same name across every hi history. Yep, there, yes, exactly. Please give your character a name. Oh, of course, yes. The only name we ever need. All right. Uh, other trace. Okay, what do we need here? Winter or edge? I don't have enough edge, but I can provide enough winter. Barely. Oh, I guess I could have enough edge with the underworld. And in fact, maybe I should do that. Because I can... I can tip that to 10. But I can't add any additional um, Okay, where is this? Okay, that's going way south and there's nothing next to that the name there. So, we're going to not go to that place. Okay, we wounded him. Got an opportunity for a villa. Come on. They're gonna steal my shit. Oh, all right. Fuck it. We'll do that. We'll send the winter. Hmm. Okay. Edge wouldn't have helped us anyway. It needs knock or forge. I can't really supply either. I can get some knock, but not enough knock. But maybe it'll just succeed, because sometimes it just pities you if you succeed. All right, we, uh, we took him out. There's also the possibility that this finds... Nope. Quiet warehouse, not what we need. Uh, in fact, what we need probably is to raise cash. Because it looks like Venice is not providing us anything we require. That's Grail and Winter, still not what we need. Disaster, the capers fail. Oh, damn. Avignon. Alright, that's in France, but not part of France we want to be in. And Vienna. Okay, Vienna is the place that we want to go. So I think, I think let's just pack up and go, yeah? Okay, it also says, does it say that for these places? Yes, okay, for all of these places. 
It says, once I leave the current city, this will never be available again. What's the card on the left below Purple Relic? Right, that's our tran Tranquility. Um, it's because we, like, watch the sunrise or something. Okay, and what's here? What would we expect to be here? It's the two... two what is it? Hands or dove or something? I forget what that's a symbol for. It's I've seen it in the game before. It looks like this. No, it's it's a different symbol. It's different hands. I don't know. Anyway. Frau is here. Seek out a Legan. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, here's what I'd like to do here. I would like to... Uh, I'd like to make money so that I can escape easily. So let's do that. Then I'd like to, I think if I attack, that will get me... Uh, you start with 70, 77 years you start with. Okay. So I can, I can move on now if I wanted to. Where would we go? I'd kind of want to try to get up to Lithuania again and then cut across. But we'll see. We'll see what it gives me. Okay, well that's the correct direction. So not the worst. Um, let's do that, and then let's do this. Yep, it's all about sevens. Okay, dangerous possibilities. There we go, we have a trace, we have a temptation for defiance. And, now I have stuff. That's uh, Prague. To actually talk to her about. So let's seek out a Legian. Legian. Uh, better bring a gift. Why, here's a lovely gift. And in the meantime, let's see what Vienna has to offer. Alright, let's learn. A weakness. I have been aware of your foe. Secluded villa. Don't really care. All right. Aha! The wolves. Okay, we've only seen wolves really in one place. The lighthouse. Yeah, yeah, the legates, they need decades. That's the appropriate gift. Okay. In my foe's case, the wolf's rage burns a fraction hotter. He doesn't fear the other hours. Okay. Well, now there's nothing left for us here. So... We just look for... I'd like to get to Lithuania, but if not, I'll take Krakow. It might be up north again. It, it might well be. But even if it is, we have a lot of stuff we need to do. Munich. Mm, wrong way. We have stuff we need to do before we, uh, we worry about all that.
Yep. All right. Crack out is. Crack out. Because we would like to upgrade our knife's secret. So, so far we've been to... One location with a symbol. And it was... It was a Legaea, right? Hey, have a good night, Zandera. Thanks for hanging out. And this just has a vault. It doesn't have an ally involved, it just has a vault. Uh, let's sell some hours, some years. Uh, explore a little bit. Opportunity to purchase a mutilated manuscript. Okay. Uh, I'm also going to pull a decade over here because we'll need to break one down. What you drinking? I'm having some Macho Libre. to us. Got Dawn, which we can go watch. Could have Thoughts of Fury, but I think perhaps Thoughts of Peace would be better. I could make a little more money. I don't think this is the appropriate time to try to make all, all of our money. <laughs> but an official connection. That ain't nothing. Let's see what kind of pursuer we have here. Let's also keep keep looking. Right, I have two cash, so I could purchase... Well, I could get the Quiet Warehouse. I could purchase the manuscript. I think I will purchase the manuscript. Well, no, I, I, need, to, I need to get actual money. Okay, this is bad. Because I can't really deal with um, Assassin. So we're going to have to skedaddle from here. Ideally, oh, to Kiev. Nope, that's not ideal. There we go. Little Paris in Lithuania. Okay. So this place is also marked. Out of here. Nice. Uh, so this place is marked, and it has Dominicus the Baker. So this place has an ally. It's marked with winter, and it has winter. So it seems like there are some marks that relate to because this is Moth, and it had the Moth person. This was Winter, it has the Winter ally. It seems like some of the marks are related to the ally you'll find there, but like this mark is not 
one of the types of lore. Neither is this. I believe that these marks represent uh, the, the Legate people, or like the cat. The cat isn't a thing. We need to figure out what those places are. Uh, so I think the next place I want to go is over here to this axe, if I can try to figure out what's going on over there. Although, maybe this is the place where we want to try to make money. We'll, we'll see. Skyrus T. Skyrius. We'll have to breach its walls and weather ghastly influences. Great. Great. Yeah, I recognize the hands from something. From one of the other DLCs or something. But I forget what it stood for. Underworld connection. Yeah, let's just let's just get that going. Was it from Priest? Yeah, yeah, maybe. Ooh, a medical thing. But I don't have the right connection for it. And let's just, you know, there's no harm in seeing what this caper involves. Dawn. Okay, right, tranquility. Let's see what that caper has. Okay. Needs knock or lantern. Well, I have some knock. Discreet office. Here, I'll take a discreet office so I can afford that. And then we can make some money! Maybe! So, theoretically, if I did this with... Oh, nope, nope, can't do that. Silly me. I could relax, though, in my discreet office. Which seems like a fine use for an office. Uh, and we need to keep searching. You can always try to change a connection. I don't know what that means, and I'm worried that we're teetering on spoiler bill. Do cities ever run out of cards? Or do they it feels like they have an infinite supply. It feels like there might be, like, ooh, interesting, freezing winds. Uh, a unique thing or two in the cities, but that ultimately. Oh, shit. I need more knock. Use my wound! All wounds are doors. Um, yeah, it feels infinite. All right, there's some contentment. Uh, what am I trying to do? I could preserve my... Is there anything cool I can do with that? No. Faith. Is there anything cool I can do with faith? No. Although, we didn't know there was something cool with cats until we clicked on it. Okay, there's nothing cool. Nearly there. Alright, now it needs... Oh, it just needs winter. And he's winter, isn't he? Something's fucking up. Alright, we're gonna get our first ally. That's very good towards our eventual end game of winning. Uh, it is not good towards our current goal of making that money. Okay, official connection is, however, good for that goal. Because with our official connection, I can get 
my medical license. Okay. I have an ally. I have a medical license. I have maggot spice. Oh no, I don't have an ally yet. And I need to wait. Ooh, interesting. I think it's probably better. I'm better off having the ally than I am just carrying around maggot spice. Um, unfortunately, we're going to have to hang out for a minute with... Uh, Oh, he's sending for the superior. <gasps> Shit. Okay, well, we, we just need to... Oh, we just need to find the place we want to go. We want to go back uh, over this way into Germany, I think. Uh, I will also need to sell... something. My office. I'll need to sell my office. No, don't relax. What is this? Theft or sabotage? Underworld connections. Yep, perfect. Rostock. Good, we'll sell my office. We'll head to Rostock. Uh, and then there we we have our medical certificate so we can um, set right up. Start taking care of business. Oh, oh shit. Shit, no! Oh my god, no. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Oh. Fuck. Okay, well, we could have had an ally if I weren't just the worst. If I were anything besides just the worst, we'd have an ally. Instead, I have maggot spice. Holy shit. That's deeply upsetting. All right. Oh, nice. I got I have Janning's townhouse. Even though I don't know Janning, let's uh let's just get right into it, yeah. I didn't even need to sell this hour or year. We could head right over to Sunshine Island and lose immediately. Oh, wait. Why did I even do this? I don't have any, any heart, anything. This is going to go poorly. I just, like, wasted a year. Heart or well, at least the first round will work. Okay, Amsterdam is up next. That's sort of heading in the right direction. Yes, Stolen Years is the main resource. An official connection. Oh, that doesn't get me really anything that I need, does it? I need money. And for that, I need heart. We're up to eight. I cannot pass that challenge unless I find something. I don't think Underworld Connection is that something. Though I will take the Underworld Connection. Because I can then use it to smuggle... Dawn. Okay, Dawn's good. So I can use that with this for peace. Which 
which has unbelievably four hearts, which is just enough to pass this second test. I'm gonna put the place I am over here. Restlessness. Yep, no health, no passion, no reason. It's 12. So unless I see another, like, sunrise or sunset. What is this? A weapon. An unusual weapon. I'll take it. If it cannot succeed... Got the Lion Hunter's Rifle. That could have gone better. Operation continues. Operation is complete. Okay, we just made four cash off of one year. So let's now get this warehouse. So if I work with this guy and my quiet warehouse, I can run a counterfeiting operation. Forge are useful. Yeah, forge. <laughs> forge. I could use cash to run a counterfeiting operation. The alternative would be um, illegal fights, which... We have had bad experiences with. So yeah, let's, let's, you know, fuck it. Let's try Forge. Let's try to do a little Forge. We, this required no investment from us. So, what's the worst that could happen? Uh, and then, uh, with, then I'll run another, Another sanatorium escapade here. Do I have any additional forge? This is forge. That is not. That is not. So cash is forge. I'd have to invest cash. All right, and this this needs heart. So there's some heart. I guess we'll see. I, I'm interested to know if I invest cash in it, will it give me cash back at the end? Uh, I'm at eight heart. I have no other heart to give it right now. Purchase art about, okay, there's, whoa, okay. So we are nowhere special. We aren't anywhere special. And we happen to get the the painting. Oh god, this guy. Okay, still don't have any heart. Uh, that's going to pass. I could use another coin. Because then I could send the moth painting. This gun only has three shots, though. I don't really want to use it on just this dude. So which place was heading in sort of the correct direction? Amsterdam. Oh, 
Alright. We'll try to hold out for as long as we can here. We'll take a wound if need be. It's not a big deal. Painting, which is the the super moth painting, and we'll drop it in there. And this no longer requires moth; it now requires exclusively forge or grail. How lovely! Very cool. Very very cool. Forge or grail, huh? Well. I don't have either of those. Got another wound. All right, once we fail both these, I'm gonna sell my assets and we're gonna head out of here. Eight cash, pretty good. Can't sell Janning stuff. Oh wait, maybe I could. No, let's not sell that. Was that the only place I had? I thought I owned a, yeah, here, I own this place. Um, and in the meantime, let's travel to Amsterdam. Guns going. You know what I could do? I could heal a wound with vitality. <laughs> While we uh, wait to shuffle off. What do the icons at the bottom all mean? Uh, left to right they are obscurity, comfort, wounds, and years. And we are already so fucking low on years, holy shit. I'm getting hella wounded. Okay. That was not great. So now I'm in Amsterdam. I feel like I know... So like, the moth thing had moths. The winter place had winter. But also, this place that's unmarked had... Uh, a... A... Pe 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 pentiment in it. Which seems to be a potential win condition. So, I don't know what the map is trying to tell us. Is comfort important? Uh, yeah, sort of. Uh, I mean, maybe it's more important than I am aware of, but the more comfort I have, I can use it to get contentment. I know that much. I don't know what else comfort actually does. Um, okay, so here I am in a totally new place. Amsterdam. So let's start looking around. No allies here. So the pentiments you need... Okay. Her. You need her. Um, well, we can at least collect. She'll give us the, the pipe, right? The little thing. You give her pentiments. Uh, she wants seven of them, I assume. Uh, however, we have one. So she'll take it and be like, oh, you don't have any more? Here's a whistle. You can call me whenever you need me. Any quality of life changes you'd like? I'd like buttons to stop blowing my cards all over the place. 
I'd like, uh, like when, when buttons spawn more buttons, I'd like to be able to, like, choose where they go. Uh, rather than, like, sometimes, like, if this came out in this direction, it would just, like, shatter my organization. It would just do that. And then you have to be, like, and if you don't catch it, well, then all your shit's fucked. Um, but that's basically it. I think anything else would just be, like, I don't know. That That's, like, an actual quality of life thing. That's not a difficulty thing. Uh... Yeah, yeah, I wish I could say any time old, unhappy, far-off things comes up, I want it to be right there. I wish I could, like, lock that button to that spot. Um, similarly, I wish I could lock all of the buttons, because another thing that happens sometimes is you go to move something, and you drop it sort of on top of a button, and it moves the button. Which is not what I want at all. Um, but other than those two things. Alright, we got the flute. So now we can call her if ever we happen to get seven pentiments. We have a sunset. That's true, I guess, I guess the ability to make time go even faster would be nice, you know. Uh, let's find the next place. So we are trying to get down here. We might not be able to go that far all in one go, but who knows. The ability to, like, draw on parts of the table, yeah, that would be, that would be nice. Okay, London isn't super the correct direction, but it's not like backwards, at least. Yes, that is the correct direction. I think we will be going there. But for now... See what else there is to do here while we're not being hunted down by anything. Could run a discreet medical thing. I don't really have enough heart to do it properly, though. This will create an opportunity to purchase either a medical license or an import license. Yeah, stack memory would be cool. So that, like... Well, sa same with buttons. is to just be able to designate a, s a s space on the board and say, right here is where I want this thing to spawn always. Um, okay, we found the C. Which means we could smuggle. I'd be pretty okay at smuggling. Let's Let's maybe smuggle, yeah? Can I smuggle in a discreet office? We will find out. Wait, how do I, how do I smuggle? I forget how to smuggle. I think I need underworld contacts to smuggle. 
I could try to turn this into Underworld Contacts. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, here's, here's another great thing. An actual gun. Now I can sort of handle an assassin coming after me. Um... Okay, profane weapon, that's great. Yeah, let's let's try to let's try to switch this into underworld connections. trace and we lost our connection but we have a quiet warehouse okay we need connections now or else we will begin losing shit uh. all right not what we need so off we go Better not lose my gun. I'll be I will be livid if she takes my gun. Oh, okay, thank you. <gasps> oh you bitch! No! That's just as bad. made it out. Here we are in Aachen. There's an there's a potential ally here, an edge ally, which is great because it's the one thing that we don't need because we already are it. So, let's talk to her. She would like to go to the Merry Feasters, hidden, so we'll need to find the entrance and then kill the thing. Well, I've got some wounds, so that'll help me find the entrance anyway. Let, let's try it out. Let's try it out. Start off with some wounds, see where it goes. my warehouse back here. Uh, Alright. Yep, I was right. Knock and lantern. We already have some knock there. Let's send some more. Connections with radicals. We could, if we kept things the status quo this time, that wouldn't be terrible. Make some money. Unofficial connection. Let's meet the radicals. Alright, and then if we work with the radicals... Oh, I need the city to come back. Night deepens. Okay, we need forge. Or Okay, we already have winter. Forge, winter, or heart. We have enough winter. I shall send... I 
I really don't have a lot of edge. I'm noticing. I shall send. I'll, sh I'll send some edge. I'll send some edge. Because if it, if the next part needs edge, I'm gonna need some edge already there. Ooh, nice. Found an iron shrine, so we can upgrade our own edge. See, like this button. What is it doing? Uh, the city is available now. Our defiance is here. We can betray an uprising. Assist an uprising. I don't want to assist. I want to betray. Well, let's betray with this. Will this use it if I if I use the flute in this way? Did we have to crawl halfway through Europe just to find a single dinky little pistol? Yes. Uh, yeah, we'll go with this. Hopefully that doesn't use up our curio. If it does, eh, whatever. That's not the win we're going for anyway. It did not use it up. Betrayal. All right. Needs winter or heart. I can supply some winter. Uh, I don't really have any more. Well, this this could be heart. This needs moth or edge. I cannot send enough moth, and I cannot send enough edge. Holy shit. Well, maybe it'll just give it to me. All right, now it needs eight heart or winter. Well, hopefully once this wraps up over here. Yeah, now I can just send my wound. We've got this guy coming after us. What a schmuck. Okay, needed more edge. Needed more edge. Now it needs 12. There's 12. Night defense. Oh, the big boy's here. That's not good. Theft or sabotage. Well, let's go ahead and get a connection so I can take care of this guy. And then I need this to wrap up so we can get out of town, even though we won't have an ally. Hostile move. Order's been maintained and the authorities are grateful. I have a connection with the ruler. Accept patronage. Yeah, that's a cheap ruler connection. In fact, we got paid to make the ruler connection. Now, what can I do with it? I can sell a year directly to it. What will that get me? Oh, shit. More than I wanted. Uh, 
I don't have any heart. I, th this isn't gonna... This is gonna not work. This is all the heart that I have. Okay, Dawn. I could go to Dawn and think of peace, and that will give me tranquility. Which is some more heart. How am I getting out? Uh, I'm not yet. I'm not getting out. It's the horrible truth of where we're at right now. Underworld connection. I feel like we're burning through years even faster than normal. A hostile move. Shoot him with the gun. I have a discreet office, or I could. It gives a little heart. Maybe I need to just get the office so I can use it for some heart. It's asking for 12. How much heart does the office give? Two. That's not enough heart. Looks like I just lose this. What is your deal? A hostile move? Knight. Oh, that sucks. I could have gotten it. With slightly better timing, I have the tranquility. Four cash. Okay, so I turned... A ruler can turn... Yeah, there is, there's no lore to be... No lore to be had, I'm afraid. Um, what did this require at the end? Was it heart that did us in here? I think it might have been. We need a knock to start. I know that much. It was edge. Shit. Now I'm doing it again. God damn it. Oh, good, the foe's here. That's great. That's... That's really good. Okay, we just need a, a new... We need a new place. We need to get gone. Don't want to see him yet. 
I don't want to go to Paris. I want to go to this place. What's your deal? Theft or sabotage? Oh, I think we can kill this dude. Oh, they won a whole decade? Too pricey for me. We'll just lose something. Oh, our icon? Sweet. Oh, okay, we have to go to Paris. It's the only place that'll take us. My foe is striking. Here, you can go deal with that. Uh, what are you doing? Theft or sabotage? Oh. Fuck. They're gonna take my gun. No, they took my medical license. Alright, that's, I guess, better. Because I can get that back. Two more wounds, please. Thank you kindly. We have some money now. We're in Paris. We have an underworld connection. We're up to five wounds. Okay. Strasbourg is the place with an icon, so this is the next place we're going. 100%. But, while we're here and we're not in trouble... Alright, I can get an official connection. Another underworld connection. There's Dawn. Bots of Fury. Bots of Peace. Can I heal wounds with anything other than... No. I could use a decade, or I could use vitality. Or I could just wait. Which is my preferred method of dealing with it. Huh. Quiet warehouse, sure. Let's set up shop in a quiet warehouse. Maybe we can smuggle. Or counterfeit. Isn't smuggling moth? Jesus. All right, well, we'll start up the counterfeiting. Here we go. Uh, 
I guess I send more cash. Unless this townhouse is forge. No. Heart and grail. Alright, well, here's some more cash. What is illegal fighting? A great way to get more wounds. That's what we found out. Yeah, that's just hard. Okay. Well, keep exploring. Keep dumping money. It's, is it really counterfeiting if I'm putting this much money into it? I could get a case of extraordinary wine. So I shall. We're, we are in Paris, after all. A great vintage wrung from a terror... T terror? To Roy? Ripe with secrets and times before the Grand Blight. With discipline, patience, and resolution, it is possible to taste a glass of this wine and not finish the bottle. Hey, Ferrisan. I've been good. I've been good. How are you doing? Okay. I have a pricey vintage of wine, so I'll, that's pretty great for us. That's a ton of grail. That is a an absolute ton of grail. I can relax in my townhouse. That might be nice. A discreet office. That doesn't really interest me. I'm getting a lot of trace right now. Okay, I can't do this level of forge unless I get something right now. Heights. Not what I need. Not what I need. There's still time to find something. What does contentment do in exile? Uh, it provides, as far as I can tell, it provides lantern and heart. Absolutely no forge, correct? Yeah. Alright, well, that's it. Okay. That's a shame. Special outcomes. I think... I made money off that. I'm not certain that I did, but I, I think I did. Alright, we've killed that Reckoner. Interesting. It seems as though by killing them, I could either upgrade this. When this gets to seven, I may be able to achieve something unexpected. The alternative is I could use it to upgrade my own edge. That's kind of a tough choice. I think I do this because I know there are other ways to upgrade that. So I think I celebrate my victory.
Paris at night. Good old tranquility. Okay. Yes, it is done. In the hour when day battles night, the many winged ones descend to judge my prize. And when they depart, they leave only scraps of bone and hanks of hair. Defeated a reckoner and proved it with a trophy. Yep, so now I'm at two. Yep, yep, yep. So there won't be seven things. There will be six, right? Because the initial, like, the first stack is just having the temptation. So there will be six other things I need to do. Now five other things remaining that I will need to do to upgrade my temp to, er, my defiance. One of which is summoning my foe to wherever I am. Which... I could do... Because it is, it is time to go. Send a gift. Oh, I could send him a, a gift because it would annoy him. What else goes here? Oh, the place that I currently am, but I'm, I'm using that right now. Okay. Send a defiant summons. Yep, yep, yep. All right. We'll summon our foe as we're packing up to leave. Yep, here he is. What's up, my guy? How you doing? Good to see you. Oh, we're fighting already. I've held off his attack. Nice. Very good. I'm almost packed up. Let's see if he's afraid of heights. Long way. Uh, it appears he is not afraid of heights. But we're gone. We're at six wounds. And we're gone. And we are up to three defiance. Yes. Okay. So another way to upgrade it is to send him a gift. Unfortunately, that gift would be the gun that I planned to use to kill him. So. Maybe not. Maybe not that. All right, where are we now? We're in Strasbourg, which is an an icon of an axe. And nothing seems to be special here. We showed up and all we got was some obscurity. I'm going to put my um, assets over here on the left. Except for except for weapons, I'll leave right here. There's Dawn. I think this time I'll have thoughts of Fury. What does Rage give me? Heart and Edge. Okay. So it's Heart and... Oh, what, what does Tranquility have? Heart and something. And Rage is Heart and Edge. Oh, Heart and Winter. Heart and Winter or Heart and Edge are my options for the time of the day. Oh, that's true. The axe is the icon of weapon. Okay, an official connection. I'll take it because that might help us get back our medical license. What is this? 
Oh, it's our medical credentials. Would you look at that? Speak of the devil. All right, we're credentialed again. <laughs> nice. Discreet office. That's just the sort of office I can practice medicine out of. Requires heart or grail. So really, I can just get lit off this case of wine and practice medicine with no problem. Right? That's all the grail I'll need. Pour myself a nice glass of wine. Run a successful doctor's office. That's what my doctor does. Nice dude. Underworld connection. Uh, we don't need that yet. Purchase an atlas of the unsuspected. A knock rarity. Well, I don't mind if I do. It sounds quite divine. I'd love to see it. All right, what is this? Atlas of the Unexpected. It is a high order knock influence. It also has grail. This began life as an atlas of the cities of Europe. Over decades, it's been extended and annotated by a dozen hands, adepts, burglars, soldiers, spies, to show secret routes and hiding nooks. Wait. Oh, I can relax with it, I see. We call this alternative medicine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that the symbol? That's the symbol, is it? No. On the atlas? No, no, no. The symbol on the atlas is the axe for weapon. That's the one by Strasbourg. You can see it in there. And we haven't found a weapon here. So I don't know if the symbols on the map mean anything anymore. Oh, the hand symbol? I think it's a different hand symbol from, from like, the Priest DLC or something. Uh, secluded Villa, don't need. They, they are, they are like, both hands, you are correct. Like, see these, they're doing, like, this thing. And then the, where's the other fucking hands? And then, uh, ah. these are just, like, this. But I, I'm pretty sure I remember specifically the other symbol from cards, just not ones in this. The Horned Axe of Shadow. Now, this was a place I could go to, but now apparently not. Interesting. Well, let's start looking for our way out of here. Uh, I'd like to get to Spain see if that means anything even though we've sort of debunked the idea that the that the symbols have meaning okay we got a little bit of cash honestly not as much as I was expecting from our days as a doctor uh, and where did oh, okay there's Strasbourg Granada Hey, that's the place I wanted to go. All right. Well, I'm content to start packing up, I guess. Let's hit the road. Shoot this guy. Yeah, what's the goal here? Uh, either lay low, lay lower than we've ever laid before, and acquire seven obscurity, 
thereby escaping for good. Or, uh, at some point, uh, figure out what our foe's weaknesses are, and then just murder him. That, that also works. Alright, here we are. Granada. We have Maria the Visionary. Uh, and so the symbol here is fucking what? Dragonflies? Butterflies? Okay, I remember this one. She pissed off the Thunderskin. We might have what it takes to to do this. We'll at least see what the caper is. Uh, we found some kites. We got our first trace. Uh, just so you know, uh, I'll just say it again real quick. Um, this is going to be our last run. Win, lose. Uh, we're going to call it here. Okay, heart and forge are what we need. Shoot. Those are like the things in which I am specifically deficient. Actually, this will give us a part. Um, this will be the last run. Uh, then I'm going to get the three separate runs up on YouTube. Uh, the, the first two and then this one. Uh, and then tomorrow, we're not playing Exile. We're going we're gonna to give my brain a rest. We're not going to do this. <laughs> we're going to let this simmer in the back of my mind. Uh, and we're going to check out um, Monster Train tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow being the 29th. Um, should get started around noon uh, Pacific time for the stream tomorrow. And uh, we're going to be doing, as far as I know, Monster Train all day. We might end up playing a little Legends of Runeterra because I am, when I'm not streaming, like if I'm looking for a video game just to like chill and relax with, it's been Legends of Runeterra pretty much, um, pretty much nonstop for me. Yes, I, I will say I am. I feel much better about. Oh, we, we'll go over. We'll go over what I learned at the very end of this run, but I, I, I am in a better place. I feel better about this, about exile. Um, I still don't know how, where I'd put it in the pantheon of the the DLC so far. Um, it's certainly the most different, and that's. You know, obviously there's going to be some growing pains getting used to the new uh, the new mechanics and stuff. Uh-oh. We need either a ton more heart or a ton more winter. And I am afraid I can't provide either. Shoot, that's Grail and Lantern, but it's too late. I, I should be able, with this, I should be able to do it the next time around. Oh, good fortune. It, it, it worked out anyway. Worked out anyway. That's nice. Cool. So now we get our very first ally, because we're not being dumb and running away uh, <laughs> before talking to her. All right. And then we will put allies over here as well. Now I could send her to make a false trail. That would give us some uninter uninterrupted time here. But I don't really know what we would do here. Try to make some money, I guess. Maybe we, maybe we try that out. Maybe we try out. 
the false path because we haven't done that yet really oh someone's already here delightful she's gonna steal shit unacceptable Oh my god, what is she gonna steal? If it's my gun, I swear to god. Uh, okay. That's one of the better things she could have taken, if we're being honest. Alright, we wounded her. I found cats, which is not ideal. I have no technique this time, so I can't guarantee a wound. A hit. Alright, there we, we've done it. We've done it again. So now I can work with this. I've already been recognized. Okay, so that that's, that's a no-go. However, I can use it just to upgrade my own personal edge. Which is what I think we'll do. Now, where is this place? Marrake Marrakech? Marrakech? It's all the way down there, and it does have an icon. Okay, so this is sort of where I do want to go. Cats can't help me right now. Let's see if there's a, a different place that we can get access to so we can use her to, to set a false trail. Um, and as soon as my edge is refreshed, I'll use it with the, the corpse here. Okay, the Priory of Captains. Could I... No, I can't. I can't send her to the edge of the world. Makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, let's refresh this, I guess. Might as well. While we wait. Okay. And I can't set a false trail here, either. Dash cross country. So, no, no false trails. All we're gonna do is um, go to Marrakech. But first, I want to upgrade my uh, upgrade my edge. Hopefully not get investigated. God! Absolutely ridiculous. Purchase a crudely carved image. Oh my god, now I can't even... How much does this cost? One? What's she gonna steal? Fuck. Once we lost our gun last time, we never got it back. I, I don't even know if you can get it back. It was just gone. <sighs> wow, that really sucks. <sighs> Alright, well, here we are. That place just had no, there were no connections there. I think I, I looked, I don't know how many times. I didn't get a single connection in that place. So I couldn't deal with the thief. 
you can't get a connection in that place. Awesome. That's really fun. So just if if they sh so if a thief shows up, they just steal everything you have. If you happen to be at that location. That's pretty cool. I think that's pretty cool. All right, connection with holy man. I already have one. Oh, all right. I could start a cult thing if I had a building. Also, I have no money again. There was a time when I had money, and now I don't. Unsure how I lost all of my money. Buying and selling. No, that's not it. Because you sell for the same amount that you buy. Official connection. So this is another, this place has the, like, knife and fork symbol. But... Okay, alright. It has a, uh... Has an upgrade place, God damn it! Oh, but I can't because I'm tranquil. Fuck. You don't always get money back from selling a place that you bought. Okay. Well then, fuck. I guess that is where all my money went. Hey, Evil Yoda. Thanks for the, uh, thanks for the sub. I appreciate it. Hope you're doing better than us out there. Better than me on this run, anyway. Cheers. Ninety seconds, and I can upgrade my edge. Echidna. Here at the desert's edge, Echidna doesn't always bother with human form. With luck, I'll never see what shape she prefers. Okay, we have a Legan. Perhaps the symbols mean there's a Legan there. You just have to spend a million years looking for them. Can I use my defiance on the shrine? Good question. Uh, let's find out. Yes. But not while tranquility is here. All right. A weakness to heat. The weather is hot enough. My foe becomes slow and stupid. Cold and the sea don't trouble him. Okay, so we need to be somewhere hot with the wolves. Or with the wolf divided's hatred. Oh my god. Oh well, at least I can get rid of her this time. Okay. Tranquility is gone. Consecration to the Lion Smith. I could dedicate myself. This will enrage you and limit your dealings with the Colonel, but increase defiance and open the Lion Smith's mysteries. Limit my dealings with the Colonel. I wonder what that means. We'll find out. We are on a, uh, a learning expedition. Stop shifting my shit all over the place. A 
Consecration to the Lionsmith. I have spilt the beast's blood and scorched my skin. I have undergone the three valorous trials. I am a warrior of the Lionsmith. Unless someday he releases me. I am consecrated now with the Lionsmith. My aspect is four. Okay. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Okay, holy men cannot uh, cannot prevent her from stealing shit. That's good to know. Maybe I just shoot her with this gun. I know it only has three shots, but... Or do you think my... Uh, do you think my edge alone is enough to deal with it? Well, you know what? We don't have to worry about that right now. We can check. We can see if we can get another uh, connection. Wasn't there someone who worked with the Lion Smith? Maybe the allies have factions. Maybe. Uh, opportunity. Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Friends in the right places. Let's keep looking. And we got her. So that it won't let me do this again. Even now that I am consecrated. But I can still use it to upgrade my edge. Okay. Cool. Alright, and we know that one of the... One of the remaining three things is to send my foe my gun. Um, which means there's only two other things to do with my temptation for defiance. What might they be? That's true. That's true. We can use, we know we can do it with radicals. So maybe overthrowing, maybe assisting the radicals. I didn't pay attention last time we assisted the radicals in the run. I didn't pay attention to whether it added a, a thing or not. But that certainly sounds like it, it would be one. High on a limestone plateau. Honestly, this sounds like the right place to be. Yo, Leland Grant. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Uh, thanks for um, you gifting those three subs. I am Chad, Cryptic Joker. Cryptic Joker, that's nice. I haven't seen Cryptic Joker in a while. That's a, oh, I'm glad to see that familiar name. And uh, Sroblem, thank you so much, everyone, for being here. Thanks for hanging out. And uh, super thank you to Leland. Thanks for gifting those subs. Um... Send it before it gets stolen. Yeah, that's true. I've done... Yes, I've both assisted and betrayed. Assisted we did more recently. And I, I didn't look either time. What is this? Cult of the Lionsmith is here. Okay. Well, I'm consecrated by the Lionsmith. So let's go there. Yeah. That seems to make sense to me. But I can't because I'm raged. Alright, we're going to wait until rage is, is down a bit. And we're going to send my foe the gun. And then we're going to go to Algiers. Which does not have a symbol.
Yes, I will lose the Pentap Pentapolis, but it doesn't have the, like, once you leave, you'll never get it again uh, text here, which means there is a, I can get back to it. Or at least that's my interpretation, because th there are some places that say once you leave here, you'll never see this card again. So I'm assuming that I'll be able to get back to it. Um, let's see. All right. Let's uh, send a defiant gift. Hopefully that doesn't just make him show up. Perhaps he'll open the package himself. Perhaps he'll think it's a trap and have someone else do it. Either way, it's hard not to laugh when I imagine his face. All right, we're up to five. We can finally leave. We are currently on attempt number three. We're still just learning. All right, here we are. Connection to the underworld. All right, what's going on here? This place is troubled. Harder to purchase desirable things, but there's the smolder of revolution which is good for us because we would certainly like there to be one we have not not really we haven't really found a use for rage um, other than just as a as a heart edge aspect We no longer have any weapons, which is not ideal. Underworld connection. Okay, connection with radicals. Hell yeah. Let's go ahead and sell some years. Uh, here's my defiance. We'll get a direction here in a second. import license uh, no we'll just wait for our cash to come through actually we can't really just wait for our cash to come through we won't have enough to assist the revolution we need to keep doing stuff Come on. Alright. Let's uh, try it out, I guess. Uh, defiance. Assist an uprising. Alright. Uh, challenges. Heart and edge. Well, I have a wee bit of edge. Oh, I could use... I could use this edge. Yo, Ray, Ray 308 win. Hey, how's it going? Hope your stream went well. Uh, what were you playing? Uh, GTA? In any event, thank you so much uh, for being here. Thanks for the raid. Hello, everyone from Ray's stream. Hi, how you doing? GTA, nice. 
Very good. Um, we are uh, we're currently playing some Cultist Simulator, so a bit of a bit of a change of pace uh, from some GTA RP. Uh, we're slowly losing our minds. Um, playing the new DLC here for this game, if you've ever ever seen it. Uh, but it's very different from what we're used to, so it's it's been a struggle here today. Uh, anyway, uh, hi, welcome. I'm Kyle. It's good to see you. Ray, how was your stream? How you doing? Started with Sea of Thieves, ended with GTA. Nice. Oh, Sea of Three, Sea of Thieves. That's another one I haven't. I, I own that. I haven't played that in forever. Huh. Not so slowly. Not so slow. Well, we've. It feels slow. After nine hours, it feels a little slow. Sent you an invite to play. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. I will. I will check that out, for sure. I will also need to figure out where to re-download it from. <laughs> but um, uh, yeah. Look into that. Anyway, so right now we're so this person's trying to murder us. We're trying to assist a revolution. Um. We're, ju we're just going to take some wounds because I think I need to send I think I need to send my edge here to help with the revolution which means oh no, okay, I can use her for defense that's right, that's right alright, we won't take quite as many wounds as I thought Revolution without dancing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, it might be. Feels like an unhappy one. Uh, certainly, I haven't even been allowed to take my wine. So how could there be dancing? I'll bring it along. Now there's dancing. I brought wine to the revolution. Uh, no defiance here. So I'm going to start taking injuries from this guy. Which is not great, but as long as we don't take seven, we're fine. Occasionally need a fourth. Yeah, I I could I would I'm very down with the idea of an occasional commitment. <laughs> That's my favorite kind. Okay, I can send her back. The Lion Smith's delight. The Lion Smith delights in revolutions. He will favor me further. Defiance has been increased. <laughs> Uh, who's hunting me? Uh, so, here's the breakdown, story-wise. Um, we are a Reckoner, which is a person who trades and deals in stolen years. Uh, essentially, you, you know that, that movie with... Who was in it? Just, was, that a, was Justin Timberlake in that movie? Anyway, the one where, like, you have, like, a wrist thing, and, and you can, your life, you could trade years of your life. Anyway, that's what it's like. Um... We used to deal in life, in years, in time. Oh, is that the name of the thing? In time. Well, that's a unfortunate name. Anyway, yes, we deal in time. Uh, so that's our currency. However, uh, what we did was steal a whole bunch of time, 77 years, in fact, from our boss, and then ran away. So, understandably, our boss was a little pissed off and is now chasing us across Europe. Um... And I guess, yeah, yeah, mostly Europe. A little bit of Africa. Mm, a little bit of, a little bit of Asia. Um, however, uh, he's trying to track us down and murder us to get his time back. So these are like the henchmen he's sending after us. However, if we evade the henchmen for long enough and we stay in one spot for too long, eventually the henchmen will call their boss over, basically their manager. And the manager's a little more difficult. And if we stay still longer, eventually, my old boss, my foe, will show up and kick the absolute shit out of me. Uh, however, uh, as we are running away, we're also, in this particular run, we're feeling a little defiant. Um, so at some point, the goal for us is to 
level we're, we're trying to level up our defiance and our edge which is our like fighting ability uh and then at some point we're going to stand our ground tell our foe exactly where we are so he shows up and then we're gonna murder that's the plan i have no idea if it's gonna go down that way uh but that's that's at least the framework so now now i need some brainstorming help uh, for those of you who have been playing, been watching or playing along, um, I need some brainstorm help. If you actually know the answer, don't tell me. But if you don't know the answer, I would love to hear your guesses. We have six of seven of our defiance uh, levels here. Each one we get from doing a different thing. So this one was attacking the boss to begin with. Uh, this was killing one of his henchmen, uh, going to a shrine, thinking it's maximum edge. That would make sense. Maxing edge would make sense to me. And then do what? Something with maximum edge and defiance? Maybe, can I even put it there? No, I couldn't do it that way. I'd have to do it the other way around. Use this and then add this to the end. <laughs> Did it give us defiance? No, I don't think... I think... Okay, here, here's what I'm thinking. There are two different kinds of shrines. There's Colonel, right? And then there's the Lion Smith. And what I'm thinking is if we consecrated ourselves at the Colonel's Shrine, the Colonel values order. So if we had done the Colonel Shrine, then we would have had to betray a revolution. Is, I, I think. I think. Um, anyway, what should we be trying to do right now? Um, I have no way to deal with this assassin, so we need to leave. But, oh, and also I did a revolution here, so there's nothing to do here anyway. Uh, so we just need to uh, move on down the road. Okay, I think he's, he's stopped attacking me for a minute. All right, let's go to Tripoli. Tripoli's lovely. Tripoli it is. Anywhere is fine. All right, now we have to load up all of our shit, because we have a lot. The index is a weapon, no? What's the index? I'm going to take another wound. That's unfortunate. What's the false trail about? So this gets created. Uh, I think this got created when I did the revolution. Um, there are certain actions you can take that will create a false trail. Uh, basically, it makes it really hard to find you. It has no effect if a henchman is already there. Um, ooh, kill a Legian. I don't even know how I would do that. But that does sort of make sense. Um, however, if you have false trail and there aren't henchmen currently at your place, there, then there can't be. It prevents them from showing up for as long as it exists. And it looks like it survives travel. So we get effectively three minutes of calm where no one's going to show up and harass us. Uh, so we need to use that time to get set up well here in Tripoli. Uh, I'm down here now. All right. So we're thinking what we want to do is upgrade our edge. And we know of two ways to do that. One is at a shrine, and the other is by killing henchmen. And we will need to upgrade it, what, three, three more times? 10 to 12 to 14. We'll need to upgrade it three more times.
Uh, is there anything... What kind of shit is here? This is just comfortable. Alright. Oh, this is the place my mom was from, so we might meet that guy who knows my parents and makes us, like, angry and sad at the same time. Alright, the C... Come on. Give me something. A discreet office. That is something. Alright, I can do my uh, drunk medical officer routine, I guess with my discreet office. So we use our medical license and our office and one of our stolen years. And yep, here's that guy who knows our parents. Uh, and then we drink our bottle of wine and we set this over here because we're a doctor now. What's today's coffee? It is Macho Libre Imperial India Pale Ale. That's our coffee. Um, Okay, what's your deal? A loyal contact, someone who belongs here. Local contact. Uh, we would like to talk to him. Call to the colonel. Okay, so we don't really want to go here. So here's what I'm thinking. What if, because our false trail is about to run out, what if we sent an ally to create a false trail? We've never done that before. Seems like it'd be nice. Oh, this is actually really nice. Uh, another lion smith shrine, so we can upgrade. Don't need to send anything here. We're already, we're already good because of the wine. I guess I should keep looking. Sending out there en route. Working on a false trail. Modest chance of each turn of creating a false trail. I really thought that would be more immediate, and I'm a little disappointed. <laughs> uh, Alright, we found some cats. Oh, we can go here now. Will this do anything? I am consecrated. Cannot be consecrated twice. Sure. This is it. To take the brazen vow. I might choose to take the brazen vow, which demands boldness in even the direst circumstances. This will give you a rage and make it impossible to win the game with an obscurity victory, but it will increase your defiance. I will take my vows. Here we go. Here we go. All right, uh, we do still need to upgrade our edge, though, because we there's no way we're killing our foe with uh, with a half-upgraded edge. That's just not going to fly. Import license. Okay. Seven. Well, okay, what, what now? Uh... What now? Alright, we got our false trail. So no one's gonna interrupt us while we try to figure out what to do. 
have a quiet warehouse. If I had a connection, can I get connections here? I should be able to. Let's reserve, get the C going again here. Yeah, like, okay, we achieved what we were going for, and now what? You know? Uh... I need a connection. Let's refresh our cats. Okay, there's a connection. Uh, I will have to break down another decade here soon, so I might as well do it. Fight him now. I don't think we want to fight him until we have full edge. I really don't. Uh... Okay, that's not the connection that I need. However, if I got a warehouse... Oh my god. Oh my god. There we go. If I purchase this warehouse, because I have the sea and the underworld, I can smuggle. I'm pretty sure. Smuggling, what would this do? Counterfeiting. Wait, how much forge do you have, dude? Oh, three. All right, let's go smuggling. I have the moth painting, so I can smuggle pretty well. Uh, an underworld connection. Send the moth painting here. How did I get the scar? That was um, Jannings. It was one of our allies. Got us the scar. Heal with vitality. We got Dawn. Our ally is back. Let's just watch the dawn. I don't want more rage, because I'll have to leave here at some point. Ooh, fascination. That's actually good. That gives me more moth. <laughs> cats also give moth, so I can send the cats as well. Okay, an official connection. That's good. Uh, where else can we go here from Tripoli? All right, and then if we use the official connection with the oh, opportunity for a import license, then we have an import license. Which I can use as soon as I'm done smuggling to import things legally. Hooray! Yeah, and I should still find his last weakness. Oh boy, the only place to go from here seems to be... only place left seems to be just running to nowhere. That kind of sucks. Yep. The only option left is a dash cross country. Oh boy. That is not ideal. Operations complete. 
I got some money. What is this? Mutilated manuscript, a lantern thing. I don't think we really care about that right now. I don't. I think, uh... Oh, I lost the C, so now it does. God damn it. Oh, god damn it. Alright, let's just. Let's just sell our shit and go. Yeah. Into the wilds. This is a last resort. Yes, it is. Yes, it is a last resort. Best of luck to us. Let's pack up, see where we end up. You know what? I might as well buy this. I have money. In fact, it'll make packing up easier. <sighs> I can't, I laid a false trail to the actual location that I could have gone to. And it left me with no options for travel. Ridiculous. Now I'm gonna have to fend off this schmuck. Alright. We went somewhere. I've arrived. Where? Where have I arrived? The lonely places between. I'm nowhere. Oh my god. Alright. Attempt to make contact with someone somewhere. You'll receive a wound each time you try to find a place. Holy shit. We gotta get out of here. Okay, got a wound. Alexandria. Hell yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Pack it up. Off to Alexandria. <laughs> oh my god. What the hell is happening? Back up the wagons. We're back on the road. Yeah, don't for, don't drop the wine. That's very important. You gotta get the wine. Yep, load each of my coins separately. If they jangle together, they'll get dinged up. Take your time. It's precious cargo. That's all the money we have in the world. Oh, the special flute that summons a witch who eats paintings? No, that doesn't need packed carefully at all. In fact, I'll just carry that in my pocket. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter a scotch. The Invisible s Serapium. Okay, we've been here before. In, a, in another life. Um, I think, in fact, knock is a good thing to find our way into an invisible place. And let's start setting up. Setting up shop. Ooh, you know what? Before we start setting up shop, what I should have done is find a false trail to lay. Okay, wounds or doors, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, there you go. There's a ton, ton of knock. Baghdad. Baghdad has a vault.
All right, find me a different place. I don't want to burn Baghdad. Istanbul. Yeah, we burned this place to the ground one time. Let's uh let's set a false trail to Istanbul. Complication. Okay, what do we need? Heart, moth, or winter. Ooh boy, and we need a lot of it. Well, I can make the I can make the moth happen. I could also make the winter happen. We'll leave it here, see what see how it goes. Alright, then let's start hanging out here, setting up shop. An import license, cool. Definitely super cool. Complication. Okay, we need more moth. And I don't have any. Oh, I could though. I could have plenty. There you go. Smoke and mirrors. It's night. Does this still make rage? Yeah, it does. Okay. What did that give us? Oh, this place. Okay. Now I can go here and talk to Dr. Blackwood. Right. Oh, yeah. She gives us stuff. Wow. She gives us absolute garbage. She can create a false trail, which we are already going to create. Let, well, what if I just don't ask her for anything? Super underwhelming. Okay, we need... Okay, we got a false trail, but unfortunately we're already being pursued. Uh... Holy shit, she's gonna steal something. Because I don't have a... Oh no, okay, here's another world connection. Okay, 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 everything's fine, everything's fine. Whew. All right, now this needs to be a connection. Or maybe I just attack her. And maybe that works out. Anvil of the Bull. Nice. My painting! Yes! Give me my painting back! Give me that painting! Fuck you, get out of here! That's not your painting, that painting's mine! That's my painting! Um, okay. We can go to the Anvil of the Bull in 180 seconds and upgrade our edge. We can also upgrade our edge with this corpse. That's two edge upgrades. We're feeling pretty good. And we can talk to this person and create a false trail as soon as this false trail is done so we don't even have to worry about getting attacked by more henchmen. We can just sit here for like a long time. We need three upgrades to edge to max out our edge temple won't work anymore well that would be infuriating 
So it probably won't. Um, here's another thing we can do is get a connection. If we have two connections ready to roll, or even just one connection is enough, then when we allow another henchman to find us, um, we can kill them immediately and level up our edge the final time. Oh no, the temple will work. The temple will work. We've already we've already done it in a temple that it, it just has to be a temple of the lion or yeah the lion smith which this one is. I thought you meant this this thing. Okay, so we go there. Boom! Make a pilgrimage. Improve my understanding of the techniques of the lion smith. Yeah, the, my temptation is maxed out, but my lore can still be upgraded. I guess I should still be reconnoitering. Boom, we know the brass forms. It's a, uh, it's a mallet now instead of a knife. Seven times seven techniques for the shattering of bone. All right, now we... Learn from my victory. Uh huh. Oh, yeah. Now we have Heart and Forge in our lore. That's interesting. What is going on? Okay, now we have. The consummations of the Helve. I am the weapon that will be broken and remade again without flaw. The argument of my flesh will at last be irrefragable. Hmm, interesting. Okay, we need one more upgrade. My, uh, my false trail's gone, which is good at this point, because now what I need is someone to show up. Perfect. Uh, what is the sacred technique? That is a great question. Hopefully all will be answered when we upgrade this the final time. I don't even know what I should be doing. Ah. They're searching. They're searching for me. Is there anything I need to sell off here? No. We are ready to go. Ah, uh, okay. It's not the guy we were hoping for. I'm gonna attack him. We might take some wounds here, but... We'll see. Ooh. Okay. The fact that that didn't wound him, we're just gonna skedaddle. The other, the other one's way easier to deal with because I can just throw connections at it. Oh my god, I can't go while we're... Oh no! Oh no! This is not good. Okay, rage is gone. Now we can now we can skedaddle. All right. Whew. Hey, Gavarok. Yeah, no, it's it's been a couple of weeks, three weeks ish, something like that. Okay, they upgraded person. Yeah, it's good that we're getting out of here. Good that we're getting out of here. A hostile move. All right, I can personally defend against that one. Could buy, buy myself the time to get out of here. After sabotage, I've got friends in the right places, just in time. <laughs> I 
think we're gonna be gone before this matters. Uh, in case we're not. Percy Stiles is waiting for me at the station. His hair is still an absurd frizz, but it's whitened with age. He looks more than ever like a merrily dissolute bishop. Dash it, good timing, he says, pumping my hand. Got a chance here for a spot of mutual back scratching. Alright, what does this place require? Let's find out. All right, let's find some discreet messages, or send some discreet messages from Baghdad, hopefully delay a false trail to buy us time to get the connections we need to allow someone to... All right, there we go. False trail to Tiflis. Off you trot. We're gonna reconnoiter. Okay, we need heart or forge. Wow, I'm still shit at those two exact things. Okay, well, there's enough. The other nice thing would be, to, oh, we have an official connection. That's really good. Uh, we would also be fine with just finding a shrine. Is there a shrine here? Okay, well, we've got radicals. Grail or moth. Well, here's a ton of grail. Don't know that we really want... Well, maybe we do want radicals. Maybe if this person shows up before the false trail. Which could happen. And if it is the steely person. Okay, it's not. Uh, complication. Okay, now we need edge or winter. I just need a little bit more edge. Oh my god, do I not have a little bit more edge? You have got to be... You've got to be joking. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, I bet these guys have edge. I bet the radicals have some edge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They sound edgy. <laughs> yeah, there's some edge. Violence is a solution. Okay, we have a false trail, so no one will attack us for a bit. For a decade, I could make a connection with a ruler, but who wants to spend a decade? Alright, what did we get? Imhalun Tectrix. It's, we got a weapon! Holy shit! It doesn't look like much, but at its touch, flesh perishes. Perhaps it really is the last fragment of the weapon that slew the seven coiled from within. We have a weapon. All right, we have a weapon again. We have a weapon. So now all we need to do is upgrade our edge to the final thing. We'll have, we'll have a legendary weapon. It can only exist once. We have fully upgraded our defiance. All that's left. I don't even know if this matters. Like, do we need to know this? It feels like I can just kill him. Doesn't it? Well, no. Because I can still only wound him one at a time. He wounds me two at a time. Which means I have to have the answer for him every time. So the reason I want to know this 
so that I fight him at the exact correct spot. Because if I don't, he will just kill me before I kill him, even though I am equipped to do so. All right, so next thing on our list, upgrade our edge. And then after, well, actually, at equal levels on our list is upgrading our edge and then also discovering this last weakness. Um, for the weakness, we need to be somewhere with a, a leggy at. Uh, I'm pretty sure we just lost our only ally. She got lost after laying the false trail, so, you know, that blows. Um, I think I just head to the next place. Right? False trail's still up, so I can't kill anyone here yet. Um, I think I'm just looking for a place that has a leggy at. Getting allies to wound him would be good. Unfortunately, I don't have any allies. That's true. I, I, can, I can also heal twice. Assuming I don't... Well, no, I'll only be able to heal once if I find a Legiat to uncover the final weakness. All right. False trail has 20 some seconds left. My friend retired to a village outside of Mashad because she was of the old region. When she fell ill, she had gone to Bezahur Fire Temple to seek healing. She died before sunset. By the time I arrived, they had already taken her body to the tower for excarnation. do want someone to show up. And uh, it doesn't really matter which one. If it's the assassin, we're, we're going to take a couple of wounds, but... No. Gotta crack a few eggs to whatever. The tiger's nest. High in the abode of the eternal snows, a monastery... So that's absolutely not where we need to go, because it will unlikely be hot. Let's find somewhere else. Samarkand. I use... Oh, this place has a Cult of the Lion Smith. So that actually sounds great. Because Mashad does not. Um, maybe we just go here. Because, I mean, at least this way we know that if we start reconnoitering this place, eventually we'll find a shrine. We don't have to count on someone showing up to murder. Also, there's no Legiat here, so... Watch me now find a Legiat right as we're about to leave. Nah, just 
sunset. All right. Here we are at the extreme edge of the map. Uh, let's find that shrine, yeah? Get upgraded. We know a holy man as well. That's pretty cool. Got four cash. Five years. There's the shrine. Easy peasy. Make a pilgrimage to the Brazen Shrine. Legiat. Uh, no, I'm, I'm absolutely pronouncing it wrong. I don't know the actual uh, pronunciation. The people who eat people and tell me things. There we go. My strength overwhelms my thoughts and I circle the shrine, growling like a beast. Through the haze of my rage, I think I hear the many winged ones whispering in the rafters. The strength of the earth, of the earth. In each rebirth there is greater strength. What has been broken can be reforged. What has never been broken must be reforged. No! So even this I can't use. <laughs> okay, I guess we guess we keep looking. How would I describe it to someone who's only gotten a couple of normal victories in the base game? How much deeper knowledge do you think this needs? None. In fact, this DLC uh, is so different from the base game that I would say uh, perhaps only like 5% of my knowledge has translated to here. And that's basically the knowledge of like how to pause things and abuse timers. Nothing else carries over to this DLC. Absolutely nothing. Um, maybe some like more, uh, like, some harder to pin down stuff, like, oh, well, I feel like this is the kind of thing that the developer would do. You know, like, oh, well, it's seven of these things, and, oh, that feels like it might be hidden in this sort of a location. But realistically, in terms of mechanics and, like, what's actually going on, you are going to be just as lost as someone who has played the game quite a lot. Yeah, there is some useful knowledge, like what aspects relate to what sorts of things. Um, but the mechanics are totally different. I need there to be somewhere else to go. But there isn't. <coughs> hmm. Well, this is frustrating. Can't leave because I have rage. Uh, I guess we'll make ourselves at home. Cats. Can I do anything with this? I need a venue. I don't have one.
That's another holy man. Oh my god. Hey, Mixel Sticks. Hey, Kyara. Uh, I'm doing all right. We're a little. We're figuring some stuff out. Uh, it's been it's been a, a big day of learning. But yeah, I'm doing good. Enjoying the game. I still don't know what the symbols on the map mean. Some of them seem to relate to the aspect that's there, and then others seem to have no correlation at all. Medical credentials. What am I looking for here? I'm looking for a location somewhere I can do faith healing, so that's what I'm looking for. Hmm. Maybe not. Maybe it's just time to pick up and go. Oh, okay, there's a quiet warehouse. But do I want to now? Someone's coming? Does it really matter? I don't think it really matters. Let's just go to the next place. Just got it. I my understanding is that there will be there will be a location that contains all three of whatever these are. That like the perfect location to fight him is what it feels like it will be. But maybe that's not true. You know, who knows? An official connection. All right, where can I go from here? Oh, maybe that is what the markings are. Places that are constant. Places are the, that are the same in every history. Yeah. Could be. Stalingrad again. That's the moth lady. I mean, Stalingrad is moving in the correct direction to get back to where we have seen Legiets before. Ohograd. Haven't been there. anywhere else to go from here except the edge of the map. Yeah. What is this? Deep in the forests of Siberia, hunting lodge, an ice blue lake. That's not where I need to be. Alright, let's go to back to Stalingrad. That's the last of my cash. Yep, traveling light. Okay, so now we've got 
this potential ally lined up again. Begin a caper. Send them off. See where we can go from here. Yeah, you don't get a cult. Does that mean you aren't a cultist? I don't know. You're definitely dabbling in the occult, for sure. Like, I am a high level, you know, I know the shattered mysteries, but I don't know that I belong to a cult. Is a cultist without a cult still a cultist? I don't know. It's like a wolf without a pack, you know? Is, is it still a wolf or is it just like a sad dog? Uh, okay. Well, that has a grail, so that'll work. Um, I guess I'm gonna send... No, I can send that whenever. What wouldn't help? For... No, I can't supplement that anyway. I'll just send this. I'm an adept. Yes, that's right. An adept. Not a cultist. An adept. Okay, there's nowhere to go from Stalingrad, apparently. So, fuck me. Alright. Now we need... Lantern. What is this? Worth. Or... Oh, no. Okay, we have enough moth. We have enough moth. I could send some more. How do you get more money? Well, first I would have to... Um, sell my years. Actually, I need to make money here. Because if, if there's nowhere to go from here, I'll need money for when I get back into civilization. Sell a couple of years, find some shit to do in Stalingrad. Got some rage. Hey, Pepperhound, thanks so much for the 100 biddies. Really appreciate it. I hope you are enjoying the uh, experience here of scrabbling through the dark to try to figure stuff out. And uh, thanks for joining me on this journey. What's the first weakness? Wolves. And then heat. And then something we don't know yet. We could, I guess, overthrow, you know, we, we could do the overthrow the government thing here. It's always a classic.
I think we'll probably end up just burning this place down. Ooh. Oh, scouring the shadows. Okay, thought she was looking for uh, something else. All right, we have an ally. We have a moth ally. connection. Don't... Oh, yeah, we... No way do we need it. We just... Oh. Well, that's not ideal. Um... Well, maybe we just kill this dude. Got two wounds. This will make three. And they're making a hostile move. Actually, I can just counter the hostile move like that and then guarantee a hit like this. Interesting. Fane of the One-Armed. An enemy shrine. I am not welcome here. Purpose. I could use my lore here when I when I get it back. We'll see what that does. Well, got another Reckoner corpse. It is nearly time to leave. Uh, we have quite a lot of trace going on. Uh, but I do want to see... Nothing. Does nothing. What about this? Can I... Learn? I can still learn from my victory? That doesn't seem... Correct. All right, let's find the middle of nowhere and start heading out. Yeah, trace is like notoriety. The more trace there is, uh, the more quicker they'll find me, and the the higher level people they are able to send. This wasn't tidy or pleasant. Okay, it didn't upgrade it. It just gave us scaftodons. This is a sacred weapon. That can only be used once. When a Scaptodon falls in battle, the lionsmith's servants often honor their sacrifice by shaping their teeth and claws into weapons. This is even better than the weapon we already had. This is the one. If he were alone, and I had a reason to believe... I mean, I think this is it, right? This is... I use my sacred technique with my sacred weapon. I think this is it. Oh, man. Alright, now we just have to survive going into the middle of nowhere. Please load the sacred weapon. Please load the sacred weapon. Yeah, yeah, I, I kind of also agree that I need to know the final, uh, the final weakness. Oh my god, load the sacred weapon. Thank you.
All right, we're out of there. On into the middle of nowhere, where we will take a wound just for trying to get out. Well, Hermitage of the Scythe. Across deadly sands. I mean, there would be heat there. It's called Hermitage of the Scythe. That's Edge. The wolf divided is Edge. Oh. oh god. Do we just try it? The concern is if I try to be over prepared, if I try to get more prepared than I need to be, I might just lose to like running out of years. Well, this is wrong. This is clearly wrong. I kind of think. Oh shit, I kind of think we just go there and we try it. I kind of think we just go there and we try it. Right? I've maxed out my temptation. I've maxed out my lore. I have the final weapon. I. We're going. We're going. Final departure. My train leaves at dawn. Have I forgotten anything? <sighs> Bank on the sacred wombo combo. Praise be. Sacred wombo. May you combo our opponent hard and with much sacred did it sacredity. Oh boy. Oh god, I'm nervous. It's going to be fine. Well, I have two wounds because I was I was stuck in the desert. But our hope is our hope is that the uh the sacred wombo combo eliminates the need for prolonged combat. That is our that's what we're banking on. So I think We'll, we'll heal with a decade if we need to. We'll heal with a decade if we need to. We'll know when we're in the fight what uh what's going on. For now, we're just going to reconnoiter. See what we can uh see what we can find here. Hopefully, wolves and heat. Hopefully, wolves and heat. Okay, sunset. Sure, let's get a little rage going, you know? Yeah, for real. For the amount of work I put into gathering the sacred shit, it, if it doesn't outright kill him, it should at least... It should do some significant damage. If it... Oh, oh man. I don't know if I can handle the disappointment of it doing one damage. Okay, it just keeps giving me different times a day. Which is fine, we've got all the time in the world. Heights. In the hills above. Yeah, okay, heights. Shit. 
Oh my god, fuck, he's here. Oh shit, oh fuck. How, what do I do? While a foe is on the board, you can't attack. What the fuck? Okay, in what order is the thing? Use sacred weapon followed by sacred technique? Or sacred technique followed by weapon? Technique first, I think. Yeah, because that's what I had been doing. I had been doing technique and then weapon. He never taught me this. Come on. I've wounded him. One wound. One wound. One wound, no heat. Hint, an immortal enemy. I can call on an edge hour to exalt my duel into something eternal, but only if I have fought him, dealing him six wounds. Oh, I'm so fucked. Yeah, I'm so fucked. I think I use this to, like, fight him off. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm fucked. I've held off his attack, okay. Oh shit, I need to be looking at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't believe this place doesn't have heat. Fucking ridiculous. Can I hold him off with a weapon? Okay, yep. Yeah. That's true. Six is easier than seven. Six is easier than seven. Oh, he broke my weapon. He broke my only weapon. Okay, we got heat. Heat exists here. What a sad disaster. What is even the point? Okay, so clearly the point of upgrading this to seven is that this is what allows you to deal the final blow. What is the point of having the sacred weapon? Nothing. There isn't one. Guaranteed wound? Yeah, I guess.
Here come two more wounds. Choo choo. This was not the right place. It puts us at six. Yeah, I mean this is it, it's it's toast. There's there's no way. I would have to roll heat over and over and over. And it seems like heat is a pretty low percentage chance. Yeah, attack with my edge and defend with her attack with the weapon, defend with edge, yeah. Unless sunset is... Yeah, no, it's not. Well, that's all she wrote. What a disappointing end. What a sad and disappointing end. It really feels like something called the sacred technique paired with the sacred weapon. Should do something. Should do something more than what I already came to expect from a shitty pistol and my tier one lore. Like, imagine. The effect that that had was the same as, like, fighting a henchman at the very beginning of the game. Yeah, there's also the problem of, um, I just don't know which end game. So, like, even if I had all three of his weaknesses, and I knew, like, the three things he's weak to, I still don't think I pick the correct thing at the end. Right? Like, the descriptions of them don't say, like, there are wolves here, and it's very high up. Also, it's hot. You know, it says... You think if I got the three, it would explicitly tell me where to go? I would hope so. Because if it didn't, I almost guarantee that I still choose incorrectly. Um... Hmm... Did we even run into three of the people who tell... No, we only encountered two of the people who tell the weaknesses. Interesting. Um. <laughs> oh, we were so close. Okay, so that actually wasn't that bad. That last run, I think, was about three... Yes, across all yes, we d we have encountered three. the uh, The questions are: Are things in static locations, or does it change each time? Um. And then, depending on that answer, how do you find what you need? If it's in the same locations each time then I need to um, remember where they are and then do my best to position myself in such a way that I can get there. And if they aren't in the same spot every time, then... Well, then we need to get lucky. <laughs> Um, also going location to location, sometimes it seems to make sense to me, like, oh yeah, these places are near each other. And then sometimes it feels like, well, why is there nowhere connected to here? You know? Um, also it seems like my, 
because at the start I was trying to check out the places with um, the icons next to them on the map, which I don't think means anything. Um, or at least they don't all seem to. Uh, it meant I was passing up on some locations with the, that had the text like, this will never appear again if you don't go there. And I didn't. And they didn't. So at the end of the game, when I was coming out of that desert, I was just rolling places at the edge of the map. And so my only hope, I think, at that point was to roll the correct place. And even if I rolled the correct place, um, it would be a matter of how many wounds it would have taken me to roll the correct place. Anyway, I think our system worked pretty well. I mean, clearly it did. We know how to level up our defiance. We, we found all seven ways. We know how to level that up. We know how to level up our edge, uh, killing uh, henchmen and also shrines. The, the last missing piece of that run is, um, is finding the weakness, which means somewhere in the early to mid game, I need to find all three of the Legiats or whatever they're called. The correct places are at the edge of the map. Yeah, I think, I think that, and that kind of makes sense. However, it is sort of like, Another thing that we really f fucked up on, we lost a couple of, we lost a couple of allies. And then additionally, uh, we forgot to get some. And I think we're all correct that like, it just makes sense if I have allies to, well, I should have allies. Ideally, like at least four, right? Let's assume I had four allies. And then, right before I go to the edge of the map, I call the foe, throw all my allies into him, and then, and then go to the edge. And then he's starting off with, although, would the wounds travel? That's an interesting question. Would the wounds travel? The foe, I know that mine do, but would the foe's wounds travel with me? Because henchmen's don't. But there's more than one henchman, you know? There's only one foe, so it would... I could see it going both ways. It's worth a shot, at least, I think. So the next time we do this, we're going to do the following things. Collect allies as we go. Um, prioritize finding the weaknesses before we prioritize progressing our defiance. Um, because if we can't find the weaknesses, then there's no point. Um, yeah, yeah, we, we really, we really, once, once I got onto the track of like, okay, here's what we need to do to like upgrade our defiance and our lore that's sort of like all that i did to the exclusion of other things I, I skipped a bunch of places i was going pretty fast um and i think we need to not do that we ended with an okay amount of hours um i would have need to use what, what did we have like 23 there at the end or something like that so i would have needed to use 10 more to get that last weakness which puts us at like 13 but really towards the end of the game You don't really have much use for the years. Sorry, I keep calling them hours. Um, you don't really have much use for them at the very end. Like when all you're doing is upgrading your, your lore and stuff. Yeah, 13 seems comfortable. Um, I'd like to get that a little better. I don't know. It feels like to get to get your money up and running requires just sort of like a decade investment at some point. But we'll see. I definitely, I know nothing about the 
obscurity path. Although it feels like the way to win obscurity is to just travel as much as you can. It's to get a bunch of money and then just travel as many times in a row as you can. Um, maybe we'll try that next time as well. But uh, the very next run we do, I'm going to try to win by killing the uh, killing the foe. Because I think we have it figured out. Just need to make a few tweaks in the mid-game. <laughs>